Today, we're heading to Iskan, Bangalore via the metro. And I had not ever been on the metro station before, so this was a nice experience. It was very clean and there weren't a lot of people inside. There was a line that you could buy tickets and really the thing to do is to buy day passes. And that's the most economical that you can find. And the trains run from about five o'clock in the morning to around 11 in the evening. Now, my friend uh, here was frisked and so was I, but we were stopped because we needed to have masks. So 20 minutes out of our way, we went to go find masks. And here we are back in the train station or metro station with fully covered masks in our face. The journey today is going to take us from the Yalechanahali station all the way down to Mahalakshmi station, which is where Iskan is located. It's several stops, but it's actually a nice ride. And don't forget, mind the gap. Taking the metro is a great way to see a city, and Bangalore is huge. The train was so clean, people weren't wearing masks, and it was very ruly and quiet. It did get a little crowded as we got towards Bangalore, and here's a girl, she actually led the way to the temple. She was in a rush to get there. It was a little difficult to get out, so I'm glad that we were able to follow her. The temple is pretty closely located to the metro station, and here we are going in line. They do separate men and women in line. It's kind of a winding stairwell all the way up to this really grand entrance, as you can see here. It was really cool. And moving our way towards the main chamber of the temple, the first thing you come to is Lord Balaji, who is a reincarnation of Vishnu, who Krishna is a reincarnation of Vishnu as well. And here we are in the main temple. They didn't want any video, but I was able to sneak some photos in. It was really pretty to see all the gold and all the flowers and the smell, the, the scents in there. It was really a nice time. Like most Iskan temples, they had a great cafeteria. Oh my gosh, all the snacks you could get, all the mapua and all the different um, sweets and desserts and lassies and um, samosas and all sorts of fried goods. Man, you could have a really good lunch for very inexpensive. They did offer a free lunch and we had waited in line about 35 minutes and then it had it moved so we decided to call it quits. But I hope you enjoyed coming along in the metro to Iskan Bangalore.